Pluto has ice volcanoes. Pluto has ice volcanoes in area southwest of Sputnik Planitia. Researchers found a series of dome-like structures that could be explained by volcanic activity spewing material onto Pluto's surface. Scientists have been looking for evidence of such volcanoes in the coldest reaches of our solar system, including on the dwarf planet Ceres and Saturn's largest moon, Titan. Because Pluto rests on the frigid edge of our solar system in the Kuiper Belt, it has long been suspected to be home to cryovolcanoes. Pluto's average temperature is a brisk minus 387 degrees Fahrenheit minus 232 degrees celsius so any slushy eruptions would likely retain their shape on the dwarf planet's surface it is so cold on the surface of pluto that liquid water cannot remain there for long in some cases the flow of material formed the massive domes that we see as well as the lumpy terrain found everywhere in this region the domes are located in a region known as pluto's heart Southwest of Sputnik Planitia, these are the nitrogen ice plains that roughly form the shape of a heart. They range from about one half to four miles. It means one to seven kilometers tall and eighteen to sixty miles. It means thirty to one hundred kilometers across. Some of them have merged together to form larger structures. How did the giant ice volcanoes form? Ice volcano mounds develop when winds push waves toward the shoreline. As these wind-driven waves crash against the bottom of the ice shelf, water gets pushed up through holes or cracks in the ice. As the water sprays out of the hole, it freezes and falls on top of the ice shelf. When they're just beginning to form, the volcanoes look more like flat, yellowstone geysers, but as more and more frozen spray heats around the top side of the hole, it creates a cone-shaped crater. Most ice volcanoes grow 2 to 3 feet high, but some can reach 25 feet. These ice volcanoes, which scientists call cryovolcanoes, cryo, meaning cold, are more like actual volcanoes, except the ash and gases they eject freeze in midair due to the planet's extreme cold temperatures.